Uh, it comes right out of the initial meeting. How quickly are they responding? I'm not having to chase them down for mm. that information. Um, mm -hmm. You know, two, three emails. It's like, mm, if they're not answering emails or they're not returning phone calls or text messages, because out of the gate, I ask somebody, example, Troy, I'll be like, Troy, how do you best want to be communicated? Because some of my clients are con um, in contracting or construction. They want a text message. I'm taking away from their money making if I try to call them or I harass them with an email. They want a quick text message, 40, you know, 140 characters or less. Just let me do my job. Um, so that's one of the first indicators. If the person's not responsive, after someone's introduced me to that person because they think they need me or they need um, to know who I am and they're not responsive, then that's flag number one. Yeah. Um, other is just knowing and understanding what I can do for them, not only on the financial um, scope, but also with just all of the people I know resource wise, I truly can help you. If you just tell me and be honest with what you need. And again, if it's not even financial at this point, that's fine. I want to be a resource for you so that you can do your job and be happy, be productive and, and catch your dreams. Um, and if they don't see that, they're not using that um, resource or what I can help them with, then we may not be the, the best pair. And it's okay to walk away. Yeah. It really scares me when people say, um, other bankers say, I can do all things for you. We're like a Walmart. I would not personally want to bank with a Walmart because that's based on price. And I will tell people, I am not Walmart, I'm Nordstrom's. Yeah. 